In this video, we are going to understand about a pictogram. Let us say you were told that in a family of 10 people, the number of apple consumed per day starting Monday were five, six, five, seven, eight. 9, 10. Make a pictograph to depict this data. So what happened is that we were told that in a family of 10 people, the number of apples consumed per day starting Monday were 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So we are given the consumption for 7 days. And make a pictograph. Now what is a pictograph? A pictograph is nothing but a graphical representation wherein, you know, you use pictures to depict some data. Let's say we have days on one side, we have Monday, so let's say these are the days of the week. Number of apples, how many apples were consumed? Let me make a circle for each of the apple. So on Monday there were 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 apples. Tuesday you had 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So I am making pictures as to the number of apples which were consumed to depict the quantity used. Then Wednesday again 5. Right? Thursday 7. Friday 8. Then Saturday 9 and Sunday 10. Now, you would be thinking as to what is the use of this pictograph. Now, this pictograph can be used to get out useful data. Suppose you were asked a question. Let's say there is lack of space, so I will write the question here. When were maximum apple consumed? Now, if you see this data, on Sunday you notice that the line of apples, and what I have done is, I have basically put them, the pictures into separate lines. So, I know that on Sunday, the number of apples which are there in the picture are the highest. 
So if I have to find out which was the day when the maximum number of apples were consumed, I can write it as Sunday. Now, if the other question was, on what date were five or less apple used? <clears throat> now, if I count one, two, three, four, five, this is the column of five. And they are asking me five or less. So, which means that it should not have a sixth entry in its table because if you have sixth entry then you have used sixth apples so which are the tables which don't have the entry of six one two so then the answer to this is monday and wednesday now if suppose again they ask me a question when were eight or more apples consumed? So this is six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So eight or more means eight, nine, or ten. So I see which entry has ticks in the eight column. So in these column at least eight were consumed so eight or more apples were consumed and these are the three days which is friday saturday and sunday so this is how basically you use pictograph to find out data i mean initially what i had was only a rough data which was not making any sense and I would have, suppose even I were to ask this question, when were eight or more apples consumed? I would need to go through this entire data. But once this is organized in a pictograph, then it becomes very easy for me to answer the questions. 